Well, here we are at Waterloo on the anniversary of the battle, and Carol is dressed exactly right for the part. Where did your interest in reenactment come from? A general interest in the period, really, starting you know, with the literature. I'm an English teacher. From that, philosophy, politics, and of course, it was a period of war, so inevitably I was drawn to war. You um, can't define that period without the war. And what, what was it in particular that drew you to the 30th of foot? That uh, was an interest in the Peninsula War, first of all, out of all the campaigns, followed by an interest in the 5th Division, because I didn't feel they got, well, they got much uh, publicity, if that's the way to put it. W would it be fair to say that it was all, they were quite ordinary? Yes, I mean, the, the division was quite ordinary. I suppose the Royal Scots are the only distinguished regiment in it, and I didn't really want to do anything with them, so I finished up thinking, yes, let's follow a regiment through, it finished up as the 30th. And Pen and Sword of the book has followed it through from, from whereabouts? Did you commence with the 30th? Um, I commenced with them when they came back from the West Indies at the time of the French Revolution. All the way through to Waterloo? All the way through to Waterloo and a little bit beyond because they were out in India as well and there were problems with Pindari Wars out in India so that was worth doing. And when, and when, when is the book published? The book was published in March. Okay. And um, I think it's doing quite well. <laughs> Thank you.